you asked, are we good? I say, we're okay. It's just one okay. That was truly a terrible effort. <laughs> That's one of your worst. That was just, it, it is. It yeah. wasn't good. It wasn't clever. It wasn't even a dad joke. It was just terrible. <laughs> Yeah. Good morning, party people. Welcome to the breakdown. Hey, Nathan Johnny here. Today we're checking out One OK Rock, as Johnny tried to hint at there. Uh, this is their brand new track, Renegades. We've had a lot of requests for these guys. Yeah, and we have been loving the bands that we've been finding out of Japan. So I've never really dove into these guys either. Um, before we go on, I want to apologize for my stench. I literally just came from a soccer game and Nathan's probably smelling my hour and a half of sweat. If you think I'm reacting horribly to the video, it's probably just me reacting to him. <laughs> Alright, headphones on. <sighs> I'm excited for this. Me too. Three, a two, a one. You may have noticed we've had a sense of this one. I'm sorry about that. Trust me, it's not that impressive underneath anyway. quite poppy isn't it like very big pop sensibilities the vocals I didn't expect I was actually gonna say that it's it, one of the things we have loved about a lot of the Japanese bands is that we can hear a bit of their native sort of accent this sounds very like Western in the way that he's singing mm. doesn't it yeah you know we got Almost a world. Yeah, I'm giving them that. That's a woe. And we love a woe. We do love a woe. Uh, very anthemic. Very, very big, big. Love that drum. It's they're a, they're a massive band, aren't they? I mean, the production of this should tell it's you It's huge, yeah. yeah. I know I have seen the name a lot over the years. Um, it makes sense now. They're obviously stadium. Guys. <laughs> I was like, is he going to finish that sentence? <laughs> So I'm going to go 
That was cool. Hey, uh, you know what I really liked about there? The giant sun. <laughs> and imagining how <laughs> sweet it. your tan would be. <laughs> I just love getting a good tan. <laughs> no, what I really liked about that was that was very easily an international song. Yes. Some of the other Japanese uh, artists we've listened to before, where it's like, man, these guys do it like no one else. Yeah. These guys do it like others, but in their own way. 100%. Allow me to explain. As in, like, that was just like, you could imagine going to any stadium anywhere around the world and imagining mm -hmm. people seeing along to that. Yeah, Even for the sure. film clip had people from all different ethnicities in there, and it was kind of like an anthem for the, like, we're all in this together. Like, you see all the people with, like, the equality signs and stuff coming up. It transcends just the Japanese culture. Oh, transcend. Is that the wordiest I've ever been? Yeah, you... Stop now. It makes up for me forgetting a word halfway through a sentence. Yeah, that's, that's true. Yeah, I really like that. That was super, super cool. That, it was um, cool. The big bridge to the breakdown. Yeah. Super cool. Um, it was, yeah, it was quite quite a safe sort of rock song, but it, I feel like it was necessary to get the point across. The yeah, point for sure. The lyrics and stuff. I really like when bands do things like in the chorus, a lot of bands like with the the main thing to do in a chorus is open it up, you know, like the cymbals become bigger, the guitars become louder. This, it kind of compressed and it was really tight and really punchy. It yeah. was all on the toms of the drums. Mm -hmm. um, it's one of the things that I used to love about Kiss in the 80s. They did that a lot and it had that real big, when you hear it live in a stadium, it sounds massive. Yeah. Um, look, I'm definitely keen to check out more of these guys for sure. It had a real uh, Normandy vibe for me in that. In the vocal style, the production, really yeah. clean, really well polished. Uh, normally a band that we both love, so I, that's a, a huge compliment from, from me. It also, and uh, this might come across really bad to say, it almost sort of reminds me of bands like Imagine Dragons and stuff like that, but not like too cliche and I don't too... Know I know Imagine Dragons. Don't worry about it. They're like... <laughs> They're not good, <laughs> but, cool. like, but it's sort of what they're going along, that really accessible, really easy to digest rock. I can imagine hearing that on the radio. Is, is that what you're saying? Radio-friendly rock? Yeah. For sure. Uh, let's also talk about the style. They all looked sick. They did. Really yeah. cool film clip too. The like, imagery was great. Imagery was insane. Yeah. The way like the light kind of like, cracked through and grew and grew and they're walking into that. Uh, very, very cool. I like the production on that as well as the song. Uh, one OK Rock, you were more than OK. It was um, very clean. I should probably go and do that myself right now. I'm gonna go and shower. Just think. There you go. 